Lightning has a flag called auto LR find, where Lightning attempts to find the best learning rate for your particular problem. Learning rate is probably the most important hyperparameter that you'll have to tune for your neural networks. Once Lightning finishes this process, the output will be a graph where you can see a plot of learning rates versus losses. And then you can make an estimate as to where you want to start with your learning rate. While Lightning finds the learning rate for you, it will then set it into your Lightning module so that by the time Configure Optimizers is called, it will use the correct learning rate. Remember that although your model is initialized when you pass it into .fit, the Configure Optimizers call is lazy, which means that it won't actually be called until it's needed for training. So the recommended way to use the learning rate finder is to run trainer.tune, which will find the learning rate for you. And then once that's complete, then run trainer.fit with the correct learning rate in subsequent runs. If your Lightning module doesn't use the property self.learning rate, then you can specify what that property value is in the flag. So you can say autofind LR equals whatever I call my learning rate in my Lightning module. If you don't have a logger, you can use lrfinder.plot and it will plot the learning rate curve for you where the x-axis is the learning rate and the y-axis is the loss. You should not pick the lowest point in this curve, but instead you should pick the point highlighted in red. This is the point returned by the LR finder. Currently, this only works for a single optimizer, and we will be adding support for multiple optimizers in the next few months. For most problems, it may be impossible to estimate the learning rate up front, so don't expect this algorithm to solve all of those problems. Instead, you can use it as a ballpark estimate where you should start to look for an actual learning rate to use in your problem.